Welcome back to Orange Hat Reviews, everyone. Ewan McGregor just can't shut his mouth. Describes Bird of Prey's Black Mask villain, or as villain for the time of Trump, in quotes. Here we go with all this political crap. Actor Ewan McGregor recently described his role as Black Mask in the upcoming Birds of Prey film as a villain for the time of Trump. He spoke with Men's Journal about his upcoming role where he described the character as an absolute narcissist. He added that Black Mask is spoiled in his upbringing to the point of having no contact with what life or people are about who has a skin this thin and wants nothing to do more than be the center or wants nothing more than being the center of attention. <sighs> Wow. And then they give a statement from his co-star, Chris Messina, who plays Victor Zaz, about how their character relationship might be a gay one. I don't care about that. It's, you know what, this whole movie is just bending on being, or is banking on full identity politics, and now politics. Look, this is a message to Hollywood now. We all get that you're whiny little pigs and squealing about your dislike for the man in the White House. I think he's an asshole too, but you know what? Stop dividing Hollywood. Stop making movies that pander to people politically and identity politically. Because... Movies are supposed to be made for everyone to enjoy. When you pander and div use divisive content, everybody's no longer able to enjoy it. But apparently Hollywood assholes like Ewan McGregor, Margot Robbie, and a bunch of other Hollywood elitists only want to pander to the people and only want to entertain the people that think like them. I'm sorry, folks. I will no longer be seeing Birds of Prey. I will no longer be giving it a review because I am sick and tired of Hollywood pulling this crap. Also, Mr. McGregor, considering you are a Scottish national and you come here and insult the country that frickin' puts bread on your damn table, stay out of the U.S., if you don't like it here, if you don't like certain aspects of things, fine. But if you are going to insult the leader of our country, get out of here. I may have liked you in the prequel trilogies. I may have liked you in the movie Brassed Off. And I may have liked you in Angels and Demons. But if you're going to pull this crap, you're entitled to your opinion, whatever. But you know what? Doesn't mean I have to like you about it. Doesn't mean I have to like it. And here's the thing, folks. Even if a person was saying that they were doing a movie making fun of the left, I would tell them the same damn thing. Keep your politics out of the movies and just make a movie for everyone to enjoy. That's the video, folks. It's a smaller one. It's a shorter one. Let me, y'all know the drill, like, comment, subscribe, share, all that jazz. Let me know down in the comments what you all think of this crap. Do you think that he should just, or do you think the actor should stop going political? And should just make movies for everyone to enjoy? Or do you believe that what they're doing now is all right and good? Let me know down in the comments below. This has been Orange Hat Reviews. I'll catch y'all on the next one.